Next test is McMurray's test. Uh, McMurray's test is for the meniscal tear or meniscal injury. Um, so for this, the patient is asked to lie supine. Then the hip and knee is flexed. And you have to identify the lateral and medial joint line. So you have to find the anterior joint line of the um, knee. So hold the anterior joint line with the index finger as well as the thumb finger. So this avoids any movement in the meniscus. So what you do is you try to make two or three movements in the knee so that you can try to find uh, the meniscus and fix the meniscus in the joint line. Then laterally rotate the tibia, then extend the knee and this will cause a compression of the lateral meniscus, uh, compression on the lateral meniscus. The same can be repeated with a medial rotation and holding the anterior joint line, medial rotation of tibia and you extend it. So if there is a pain or a click or a pop, then it's possibly a meniscal injury. If there is a pain with the lateral rotation of tibia, then it's possibly because of the lateral um, meniscus. If there is a pain in the medial rotation of tibia, then it's possibly because of the medial meniscus.